Hi, welcome to IGCSE Math. In this video, I will going to tell you about the types of the slopes. We have four types of slopes, that is positive, negative, zero slopes, and the undefined slopes. Let's have a look at the positive slope. What is positive slope? Positive slope means that the line is increasing, and in other words, moving from left to right. When our slope uh, is positive, so our slope value is greater than zero. And if we have the change in y value and change in x value in positive, so we got the positive uh, slope. And if our change in y value and change in x value both in negative, so at that time also we got the positive slope. Look at this graph. Here, uh, this line is increasing from left to right and uh, is inclined, is getting increased. As x is increasing, y is getting increased. Then here you can see uh, as uh, x is increasing by 2, y is increasing by 2. x is increasing by 2, y is increasing by 2. If x is increasing by uh, y is in, uh, here, x is increasing by 2, or y is increasing by 2. So our slope is one look at the next type of slope what is negative slope negative slope means the line is getting decreased getting declined moving from right towards the left the more the steeper the the line so our slope is getting negative so it will be uh, less than zero and if our change in y values in positive and change in x value is negative so the slope we uh, get is less than zero. When our change in y value negative, change in x value is positive, the slope we get is negative and the value of slope is less than zero. Here we have the line is getting decreased, declining. So in this um, negative slope, what happened as uh, x is increasing, our y value is getting decreased dramatically. If our x value is 1, our y value is 2. So y value is getting decreased. So I will take minus 2 and over 1. So the answer is minus 2. So in this way, uh, we can uh, find out the slope from the given line. Look at the third type of slope, that is zero slope. The zero slope, on the other hand, means the line is horizontal, parallel to the x-axis, like this. And when our slope is zero, so the change in y value should be zero. When the change in y value is zero, so our slope we'll get is zero. Look at this graph here, a horizontal line that is parallel to the x-axis and the line crossing the y-axis at which point that is 4. So uh, anywhere I will take the point, the y value should be same. So a horizontal line has gradient of 0 and horizontal line all points have same y coordinate, but the x coordinate can take any value. So if uh, I want to take out the equation, the slope intercept equation, so I will uh, get this equation only. y is equals to 4. How? Uh, here you can see I already take two points, that is 2 is on x-axis, 4 is on y-axis. So y is always same on horizontal line. The Another point is 4 is on x-axis, all the y values is same. Change in x value can take any value. So if I will going to solve this, what will be our slope intercept? equation for suppose here I have this uh, the y value is 4 and then y2 y1 this is y2 and this is y1 and again uh, uh, another the, uh, the x2 and x1 
so our y value is zero and change in x value is two. As the zero will going to divide with two, answer will be zero. When we have the horizontal line that is parallel to the y axis, so our slope will be zero. Our fourth type of slope is undefined slope. Slope may be undefined. Uh, that means the line is vertical. Means the line is parallel to the y-axis. Undefined, the value we get from the seven coordinate points is undefined. For undefined slope, our x value is always the same. Like here in our graph, the whatever point I will take here, here, or anywhere, our x values is always same. But we can take any y values, any point, but our x values should be same. If I'm going to write the slope intercept found equation for this vertical line, our equation is x is equals to 2. How? because here gradient is undefined. Now I am going to plug in the coordinates uh, of the given point so uh, we can find out how the slope is undefined. Here I have the formula of slope, change in y-axis and change in x-axis. So our first coordinate pair is 2, 2 and the second one is 2, 6. So as I plug in, I got 4 from the change in y value and 0 for the change in x value. In mathematics, we cannot divide any value by 0, so our slope is undefined. Thank you for watching my video. If you like my video, please do subscribe to my channel and hit the like button.